Hello everybody and welcome to Forza Horizon 3. So today I'm going to be showing you the treasure map which uh, will be handy to some of you because it's actually, it actually costs a, a tiny bit of money and some of you obviously won't want to purchase it or you've got to ask your parents and actually it's just a bit of uh, effort. So we're going to have a look here. Um, so the treasure map it just shows you where all the beauty spots are, the discount boards so it doesn't cost you as much to travel and the XP boards. The ones here that are light grey, it means that I've already got them. Um, it also shows the barn finds and the random ones out in the canyons and the water. There's one in the middle here, which is quite tricky. If you have trouble getting that one, let me know and I'll upload a video for you. But there's actually a path in the middle, so it's kind of like here, I think it is, where my pointer is now. And you come across it like this and you've got to go round it. Otherwise, you're going to fall in the water and you're just going to reset. So yeah i'm just going to go through and show you the map bit by bit just so you can pause it if you need to and think oh if i just mark there i'm going to get this xp one so this is the dry reservoir so just take a minute to have a look at this one and yeah so we're going to go down here to kiowa valley so we've got a few here as i said i've been through and just checked them through on co-op which you know i i think i was quite interesting I've played it with my friends um, sometimes I go back into single player and find that actually it hasn't progressed so just be careful there um, so we've got a load here we'll go over to the rainforest now so if you need some here so we've got some down here I've still not been over this side to complete these ones um, so you can pause it there I'll come down for you yeah so you can see all of the XP boards like here if I come off it it'll highlight them all um, we come up and we've got this here, the shipwreck, there's a few over here, look on the right, and then we'll go right up to the top to Surfer's Paradise, and there's quite a few around here. Not as many as the other places, but yeah. So, that's that for you. We'll come out of here. I thought today that I'd share some, uh, some little hints and tips on how to go up some perk levels so as you see if I come into here and on my progress we've got the skill shop here and on the instant rewards I've unlocked quite a few I really wanted the mini cooper so I was like do you know what I'm going to do this I'm going to go around in the fields and go up loads of skill levels so what I did is when me and my friends were looking for a barn find is I came to this little spot here so if you look, it's right next to the uh, Yarra Valley Horizon Festival and you come over into the fields. If you've got the barn find, it's going to be much easier to find. So there's some fields here and literally just go over to them and, uh, oh, I've got a new barn find. And what you do is you come into this field here. Now, you'll, you'll be really lucky or if you even wait around and your skill song will come on, which gives you times 10, which is double what your normal skill set is. So if you just come into here and just literally drift around and you get the points for side swipes, you have to keep it going because otherwise it um, dies down. So we've got side swipes and then because we're doing wreckages, then it's also putting your points up for that. I mean, look how much I've got already. See, there you go, it's stopped. So you don't want to stop. You've got to keep going, keep up the drifts. And I'm sure you're better than me, but you've just got to keep it, keep it on top form and then if you run out of trees, just literally come down here. It's really, it's really easy to do. You know, I think my highest one is a million that I've got because it times 10. So come here when your skill song's on. As I said, it's just, uh, it's just here, looks, so and next to the dry reservoir. You can see the fields quite distinctively, actually. So it's actually quite easy. So just come over here and do that. So, yeah, I'll keep going and see how far I can get for you. Um, I got the Daytona yesterday in a barn find, which is pretty cool. I'll actually, uh, I'll do this barn find whilst uh, whilst it's come up and on the video for you. So actually you get a taste of what the treasure map's like. And you know, if, you need, if you're struggling on some barn finds, let me know and I can share the information with you. I'll send you a message or a picture or whatever to help you find that barn. So we're just gonna keep going around. So as you see, I've got awesome records, side swipe. The fields are huge. You're not gonna run out of room here. Um, just don't hit a tree because there are a few trees on the outside of the fields and then you're going to lose your bonus um, your score that you've got up 
um, knowing my luck I've said that and it's going to happen to me now um, so here we go I'm on 30,000 you know I'm not going to do it for too long because I don't want you guys getting bored and I want to show you this barn fine because obviously I haven't got this one yet um, but yeah it's quite good and it will get you those points that you need see so I've got 166,000 what I found is I think you can only go up three levels each time you um, do it and then it stops so actually if you want more skill points then maybe you should stop and start doing it again so there you go I've got two um, I think I should work on my skills a little bit more because these are pretty cool I want to get the Gallardo um, that's 30 as you can see and the XP really helps because it takes you up levels now I got the early release edition so I get the VIP spins which is really cool hopefully I'll go up a level whilst I'm talking to you guys and I'll show you what I mean so you come into the wheel spin and you can win VIP cards like Forza editions now I've been quite lucky I've actually got the F type project 7 Horizon edition which is really really good I love this car which is what I'm in now let's take a look at it we've got this and I like the paint job it's pretty cool I can't remember who did that but thank you for that so we're gonna come out and have a look at my cars now this is the reason I really wanted the mini because I love doing this to it it is pretty cool and here we are mr. Bean classic just a pure classic so we're gonna go straight back and I purchased Halo 5 so I got the uh, Warthog which is pretty cool um, if you want to see any of these cars in action just let me know and I can video it for you I also won the Atom in it that's not a Horizon special but it's pretty cool haven't done it up yet and it's already an S2 uh, I've got the R8 the RS4 the BMW team now I got that in a DLC because I also got the early release I've got a Fallout skin for it which is pretty cool uh, I've got the BMW M4 Coupe and that's another Horizon edition I uh, I won as you can see you get the credits boost that one's pretty cool so that's just a muscle car if we come back different cars give you different um, XP boost so that one is a uh, just an XP boost and as you saw this one is a credits boost so I'll get more credits for what I do I've made the Dukes of Hazard car which is pretty sweet um, yeah so the Shelby I want to make that into the need for speed car the Mad Max car, which is really good. I love that one. Um, got a few classics. The Conan's Dagger. See, that's the, I'm not a big fan of that. Let me know what your favourite car is in the comments below. Uh, I got that free as well. Yeah, so I've done a few Fast and Furious cars. As you can see, it's Brian Skyline here, which I'm a big fan of Fast and Furious. And his very first car in uh, Fast and Furious 1. And I've also got the Ultimate GTR. So, yeah. I've got a few cars to choose from um, actually I'm gonna come into here and I'm gonna get out the Mad Max car because it is pretty sweet so we're gonna go through it's even got the charger on the front of it so it does cost 10,000 credits to um, to get your car which sucks a little bit but I guess that teaches you for being lazy um, waiting for the car delivery we'll go and do this barn find and then I'll finish the video so you can uh, experience this barn find with me so we're going to mark it. As you can see, usually this purple bit wouldn't come up. So I can just mark it straight away because I've got the treasure map. So I'm going to go through here. And I actually love taking shortcuts. So I'm going to be a little bit lazy and come through the fields, actually. So let's go down this way. I love the way this car picks up speed. There's a few jumps, you know. And that's a pretty cool addition, the jumps. I enjoy that. Uh... So we're going to come around here, come on don't crash, yes, so we're going to cut across the fields because like I said I'm a bit lazy to miss the tree, no don't hit the tree, come on come on come on don't hit it and we're going to just cut across, this is a little bit like Mad Max actually that's an awesome game as well, it's a little bit old so I won't do any coverage on it, um, FIFA 17 is out this week and I will be covering that, whoops there's a big uh, rock there uh, so yeah if you enjoy FIFA 17 stay tuned into the channel remember to hit subscribe and like button because you know that's what counts on here that's what helps me get recognition and f for me to know I'm doing the right thing or the wrong thing so we're here so we're gonna go right into here let's see what we've got today let's see if it's of any good now I got the Daytona yesterday which is pretty cool 
because it's like the car from Cars. Oh, only fools and horses. If you know what I'm talking about, good on you. I think I'm going to do that up as the only fools and horses, and I'll show you in the next video. So yeah, like I said, guys, if you need any help with anything, you just hit me, hit me up in the comments section and ask me any questions you want. Hope you enjoyed the video, and I hope the treasure map helps you guys. And I will see you soon. Take care. Goodbye.